Well, <clears throat> I've seen some products out there, and um, most of the products out there overlay on top of someone else's system. So what I mean by that is you have a control system running a building, and there's software involved where the software is telling the, the relays and the sensors what to do and the valves what to do. And then someone else will come along and put another layer of software that sits on top and talks to that layer. So when something breaks or something wants to get changed, it's very difficult to change anything or determine whose problem. Is it the new layer or is it the old layer that's giving us a problem? What we do is uh, we come in and we actually use the fiberglass, we use the relays and the sensors, and uh, we actually use our software on the original component and we take and put our software on the original component, which uh, allows us to be uh, solely responsible for fixing anything that breaks. So if uh, we, we're, not, we're not tied into someone else's software that has an issue, we put ours on it. Uh, if something was to uh, malfunction or something wasn't right from the get-go, then we can change it and we can tweak it and we can make it right for the customer. Uh, if, uh, if that component was to fail, then we can put uh, one of our controllers in its place. I think what makes Compitrol's integration solutions different from other people is the fact that we integrate so deeply into uh, systems depending on the requirements. Um, there are a lot of companies out there that are started by engineers that really don't have field, uh, field service experience and they'll show you the glossy video and the pretty web front end but when they actually go to deploy it there are a lot of problems you can run into. Uh, programming inside of controllers, database porting, and all that kind of stuff. So we can integrate directly with the front end. We can replace the front end. We can integrate with controllers or replace the controllers. Uh, our technological expertise goes pretty deep into the building, and we never really run into buildings that have problems that we can't handle.